Hi Libra, welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to get you an update on how the person on your mind feel about you right now. And today is the 7th of July, 2023. And time here in Bali, Indonesia is 9.43 a.m. Okay, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me. The person on Libra's mind right now, how, how do they feel about Libra? Just think about the person that you would like to know how they currently feel about you. It can be anybody, okay? Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and this person. Don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe if you resonated with this reading. Ten of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Wow. And Five of Cups. Eight of Swords, Five of Wands. They feel really conflicted. They feel so down, so devastated, so sad. Could be a sense, you know, Five of Cups can indicate someone who is regretful, remorseful. Things didn't happen the way they would like it to happen. And we've got the Eight of Swords here. So they can't stop thinking about you. They're stuck. I feel like they keep thinking they, they keep thinking about what had happened between two of you five of ones where both of you were maybe fighting, arguing, some altercation, ten of swords. There's there there has been an ending between you and this person, okay? And they don't feel good about it, they're really sad about it. Three of swords here someone first. They're conflicted whether they should heal the situation with you. And then we've got the Ten of Pentacles in one verse. They feel like everything that both of you have worked so hard for or worked so hard towards is not materializing. It's not happening. And Two of Pentacles here is in one verse. They could be feeling sad about a decision that has been made either by them or by you. We've also got the Justice here. They feel like... There needs to be some sort of a fairness in the situation that with the Knight of Cups here, they could be deciding whether they should, in the midst of deciding whether they should reach out to you and make things right with you, justice, right? But the justice that can also indicate marriage, some sort of commitment. So they're sad about a certain commitment, a certain situation that is maybe bound by legalities if that's even a word okay it's bound legally so just giving you an example this is just for some of you okay libra if um say if you're married or if they are married there's something about marriage married to someone else if there's a third party situation or married to each other something is going on with the the marriage okay or the, somebody's marriage could be the issue um, of the situation if it's a third party situation but Libra you know this is a general reading and it may not be a romantic connection that you could be thinking about right now but whatever the case is justice indicates something that is legal black and white um, something official but could also indicate karma um, they could be feeling this person could be feeling they're receiving the karma right justice um, can also indicate them feeling as though they want to make things right with you. Hmm. Wanting to be fair. So they could be feeling like they need to treat you fairly. Kind of with the Nine of Cups. Offer you love to try and treat you fairly. To do it. To do things the right way after this separation or arguments. Drama. And we've got the Ace of Pentacles here in our first. Yeah, so they feel like a decision has been made that could have caused something not happening between the two of you. Something that both of you want to achieve, something that both of you want wanted for the future, in the future. It's not happening, it's not materializing. So they are, they are stuck with the Eight of Swords here. Um, in those thoughts of how things just didn't pan out the way both of you wanted to or the way they wanted to let's see more they do care about you not a cup so 
They appeared twice already. Could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. If it's not Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, it's just somebody who cares about you, somebody who does love you. They care enough to cry over it or feeling disappointed about it. And also we've got the Four of Cups right here, the Hangman. They feel like something needs to be, something has been sacrificed or there needs to be some sort of sacrifice between the two of you. And the King of Cups, again, Four of Cups. Currently, they are very in their own thoughts, in their own feelings. They are still mulling over this thing here, Ten of Swords and the Five of Wands, mulling over this ending, or it could be a sense of betrayal, whether they betray you or you betray them, either or. Um, and the Five of Wands is like this chaos. And the hangman, they feel like they need to kind of take a break unless they feel like they're giving you a break or giving this connection a break. Let's see more. Page of Cups and Verse. Hmm, so you've got two, you've got three cups here, which is not a cups, King of Cups, Page of Cups and Verse, and the Queen of Wands and Verse, Six of Swords and Verse. Yeah, they, they feel like they just need to stay stay in their own feelings, keep to themselves right now because the King of Cups is somebody who keeps to himself and the Queen of Wands in love first. They feel like you are dissatisfied about something, about them. You're ignoring them. You're not giving them a time of a day unless it's them wanting to just keep to themselves and don't really want to take any actions right now because they're not sure what to do five of wands right and the hangman here again a big pause so they feel like they need to think a lot about what has happened between the two of you they need time they need a break or that they feel that you've been thinking a lot and that you need time you need a break from the situation I definitely see them feeling really disappointed because it feels like maybe both of you had have had plans about the future that not has come to an end or it's leading leading towards an end. And they feel like there's no way for them to do anything. They, they can't do anything right now. They're just so stuck. But the King of Cups, again, it's them feeling like, I still care. I really want to fix things, I really want to heal things with Libra, through Swords and Lovers, do right by Libra, but I'm stuck right now, I can't do anything about this right now, even if I want to. Let's see, just a little bit more Libra. The star in my first, yeah, they feel like there needs to be some healing and recovery. The higher find a world fortune. They're just kind of waiting and see and try to have faith that everything is going to be okay. And the, the world of fortune here also indicates them feeling like maybe this is it or a big change needs to happen between the two of you. The Hierophant can indicate marriage. You have two cards that indicates marriage. Again, a marriage could have been the issue of the situation, or it could be because of a contract, something legal, or promises that have been made. But the Hierophant can indicate teaching and learning. They could be feeling like, okay, I've learned from my lessons, or that I need to teach Libra a lesson. Again, it could go vice versa. They feel like they would like to give you the the things that you want, which is important to you. But right now they can't. They are stuck in between something else that's going on with themselves, with their life. Could be external, could be internal. Okay, Libra, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my other channel. It's called Chelsea Vlogs. It's my travel channel. For those of you who like to be notified every time when I post your videos and every time when I go live, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. Yep, Libra, take care. And I hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Bye.